Hey, what's up everyone? In this video, we're taking a look at the mild stability shoe from 361, the Strata 4. Right guys, so the Strata 4. Now, this is super cool uh, in terms of stability. I really like a mold stability shoe for when I'm being lazy. Uh, and this is why this shoe fits nicely into my rotation. Uh, let's get into some of the stats and the features. Uh, this is 135 pounds here in the UK, but you can actually get it cheaper. Uh, you've got the Morphit upper lacing system, uh, which is a multi-dimensional lacing des uh, system designed for about comfortably harnessing your foot. I'll show you that in a second. You've got an engineered mesh upper, a newly designed pressure-free tongue construction, uh, Ortholite insoles, 20% uh, recycled content, which is good. You've got Quick Spring Plus, which is an EVA foam designed to give uh, more rebound, reduce compression and resistance to extreme temperatures. And then you've got the quick foam, which is a midsole material made up of EVA rubber blend with PU coating. Shoe's got an eight mil drop and it's 334 grams. So it's not the lightest shoe in the world. So let's get onto the stability part of it first, because I think this is where it comes interesting. Actually, before we do that, I must apologize. Have a look at the state of these. Now I like to clean up my shoes before we review them so you can see everything uh, in all its glory, but I totally forgot, my bad. Anyway, we'll carry on. Just remind me my hands are going to get filthy. So here we go. This is the sort of stability element. Um, very similar to an Ultra Provision 4, which I've got. Um, and uh, also, if you've not seen it, I've got done a review on the Provision, um, Provision 4, the Prism, which is a mild stability shoe, and some other mild stability shoes out there. But this lacing system comes around here. So you've got these tabs, and you've got the laces that pull in from around here. Now, the tongue is not connected on this side but it's totally connected on here. Now the idea is, is that cradles your foot and harnesses your foot and stops you doing this. Now I've noticed that when I'm out there and I felt a very neutral strike from the shoe, which is a big compliment to the system. It's not overly complicated what they're trying to do here, but it definitely works. You've got this structure down the side as well. And yeah, it really does, well actually, it's really not noticeable that you're in a mild structure shoe that makes any sense. Um, you've got plenty of foam cushioning around here, so it's a nice, soft, comfortable place to be. Engineered upper is very breathable. Um, the outsole, like I showed you because it's dirty, is great. The outsoles from uh, 361 are fantastic. Look how much traction's on there, especially for me down those canal towpaths, people. Look at it. Um, the quick foam, now, the ride, I would say, is, is comfortable. It's not, it's not a racing shoe, it's not a tempo shoe, it's not up-tempo, anything like that. You can pick up the pace in it. Um, you know, it will comfortably you know, drag yourself along. But this is not what this shoe is about. This is a daily trainer that can do it all with mild stability. And I think they've hit the right notes here. You can tick all the boxes if you are looking for a mild stability shoe, which is comfortable to run in those sort of 5Ks, 10Ks, up to half marathon distances. It will do all of that and it will do it very comfortably. And I think that's the best way to describe it. Yes, it's on the heavy side. Yes, you've got quite a lot going on here, but they're offering you something that I think is quite interesting and different from some of the other shoes out there. It's a different take on the sort of stability element, but they've added this sort of nice cushioning um, very soft and plush feel around the, you know, the whole foot area. Combine all that together with that sort of daily trainer. I think they've they really hit all the right notes with this shoe. So if you're looking for something different, uh, and that's the good thing about 361, they offer something different to your Nikes, your Brooks, your Asics. Have a look at the Strata 4. It is a really comfortable shoe. I find myself grabbing this for those recovery runs more than other shoes at the moment, uh, and that's a big compliment to 361. They've obviously done something right uh, in my memory to, to keep grabbing this shoe because I do keep dragging it out of the garage for those recovery runs. It's just to say, it's just a really nice, comfortable shoe.